Hello everyone, welcome to the episode of my Ruger Bay of the Shwood Divide and Conquer. Last time we took was Gilead, completely. It's ours, finally. And we shall uh, occupy it. I don't want to exterminate, it doesn't have that much people in inside of it. And we're not super far in the, 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 uh, the actual campaign yet. We're only on turn 84, that's not that far. Considering we actually already... All actually the regions we need, and we killed off the hill and the win already, and we actually control all the settlements. Actually, we had to control the hill, so I had to buy a freaking motor. <sighs> Still too costly. It paid off. It, it, I think the hill pretty much paid for itself already, so yeah. Still, considering the buildings I built in there, it will pay for itself eventually. I hope. My God's sake, expensive bastard. But hey. Generals 11. I don't think we have as much as I could have. I mean, I can have a lot of them. The Dark Lord doesn't love me. I don't think he. I don't think he doesn't love me because I've used his entire. <laughs> yeah, probably used his entire. Actually, I should just commission an invasion. I just sent all the enemy factions to Rohan or something just so they keep out of this entire conflict. That actually, could be an interesting thing. Or I can keep an invasion and send him off to a Gondorian settlement and I actually can have one of my guys go after it. And he becomes very powerful because of it. That's actually very... Uh, nah, I'm gonna do that. There's no point in that. Um, Umba love, he lo loves Umba and Haradrim. And... Count. Oh, that's actually Umba, this is Count. Wow, I'm having a complete mess up. Ice God still lives, which is a very weird one. But yeah, we kind of have the best thing. Capital City is a mystery, of course. And kind of the only thing we have to do is kill off Gondor. That's it, really. And... And the campaign is in theory over, but I'm not gonna stop there, I'm gonna continue with a little bit further, of course. Because it's pretty early on. Add good a champion. Well, he just obliterated that, didn't he? He is the champion of my people, he's my... He's actually one of my favorite generals, he's not that great, if you think about it. But he's my second, well, I have two, three favorite generals, of course, my, my faction leader, my faction heir. And then I have this guy, I normally have in every campaign I do, I have like one guy. He's not a faction leader, he's not an heir or something. He's not even part of my family, but somehow want? he's one of my favorite generals. Any for campaign. I had that with Call of Warhammer as well when I played that, and you know, I had one guy I got on level um age 18. I just build him up to be a powerhouse of destruction. I mean, really, I just turned him into a god in the end. Or he killed off like I think, I think every he fought through the mountains against nine goblins, and normal goblins, and orcs. And I think he, in his end of his career, he killed off like. One million of him? I mean, I just, I mean, every battle he did was like 10,000 goblins, 10,000 goblins, like 50,000 rows, was insane. But hey, it was fun. That actually was insane, to be honest. Once that battle at 50,000 goblins, that was nasty. A lot of dead, dead goblins in the end. But hey. Alright, so, what are our plans? Well, we're gonna take Brimblad, and then we're gonna take Istion out. See? He's probably the strongest army I ever faced of Gondor. It's probably it's gonna be the strongest army I face of Gondor. It seems to be the elite army of Gondor. It seems to be the only elite army they have. It seems to be the only military mind they actually have left. So we're gonna actually check it in the faction room because here we are. Gondor overall they're still strong. Wow, they're pretty strong for overall. I'm I'm just getting ridiculous. Military they probably military. Wow, there's wow. Where, where are they getting the armies from? What the hell? Where are the armies? That's also a question. Territorial. How much do they still got? I know they have a lot of settlements here, blah blah blah, but oh, I didn't know there were that many settlements. <laughs> what do you know? Financially, well, I'm getting poor because, well, population, they're still growing? How is that possible? How are they still growing? I just took out how many cities of them? Alright, so Gondor is still a powerhouse. And actually, and normally Gondor is, is actually living from these settlements over here. The, these, these settlements over here are the the money of Gondor. That's where most of their armies cover, most of their mil well, most of their financial stuff, and pretty much everything comes from those, let's say, four, five cities? Yeah, most of it comes from here. And then you also can count in these two, maybe, and Pelagir as well, but that's minor. Actually, Pelagir is going to be a very hard city to take, I believe. Well, actually, not that much, considering what's inside, I see. Huh. But hey, we're going to... Orders! We're gonna My move you out here. Place. I know where it is. I don't need to see it anymore. And let's end the turn. See what happens. Probably should need to check if I can build some more gold units. I probably need to check that. I also need to check what we can retrain at Aerobore. But hey. 
and also be to check actually our faction air, which is waiting for a little reinforcements to take out Galadrim, which is not going to be my main focus of the war. I mean, the Galadrim is a minor army, a minor faction that is not going to fight me. They can't reach me because Mercury is in the way, you know. Plus, I don't think I'm in war with them, to be honest. But hey. We also need to go after the dwarves of Castle Doom if we really want to finish off the dwarves there, right? How it goes. And we can open a front to Eriador, which is a big land and contains lots of riches. Considering it also contains a lot of enemies like Bree, Dunaday, Dwarves of Erdlowin, and then we have freaking Linden with Glorfindel. Hello, Glorfindel, overpowered bastard. How are you doing? Bleating our forces! And we also have Separating Rohan, which I, I don't want to fight. I like Rohan. That's how it goes. I, I just Bleating I just enjoy go Rohan. I never want to go in war with them. The men. If, I want to, if I go in war with them, Bleating I'm always feeling forces. sad. There's reasons for that. I'm not going to explain, but As there's reasons for that. Splitting the army. Something with other games I play and I just the men. getting sympathy with them. But hey. As you will. Splitting the army. I know you're splitting the army. Get Bleating moving. Our forces. Merkwood, how powerful are they? I mean, As they control will. their lands, Splitting yeah, the pretty good, but they're not that big. Well, they're actually kind of a part of my, uh, in my lands, which is annoying. They just, just, they just cut up part of As my my, uh, my lands. Huh, those guys do. They are wanting... Our forces. What do you want from me? What do you want from me, Dwar... Separating the men. What was that? No. Yes, will give me money. Fires flicker in the sunken skies. Actually, that is a nice picture. Well, that is not a that is not an orc. I'm pretty sure about that. That's not a picture of an orc. By the way, that's way too advanced ar armor for an orc. There's no way. <laughs> not even Uruks wear that advanced armor. How may I serve? But yeah, of course. Eh? Where am I to judge you, right? All right. Where the hell are you going? Get the freak to Arambo, will ya? Let's see what we can do in Arambo yet, alright. Not much, but hey, it's a start. How much I need here for the good army? Uh, still too much, hey. Alright, uh, some misty mounds here. Alright, so what are you doing? You're, oh, you almost have, Orders. actually you have your army out now. How may I serve? An honor to serve. Your Orders. army is ready. It's not a big army, but hey, it's something, right? Yes, noble master. Uh, How may I go serve? Here. As Those you are mounts, right? Yeah, they are beast mounts. An honor to serve. Grab them. Yes. Uh, go. I will bring our forces together. Am I a No, I'm not. Alright. Uh, I was thinking, like, did they attack me? Alright, I can actually improve this element, which I probably should have checked a long time. Better tanner. Uh, practice range. Town guard. Roads. Always good. Uh, keep it off. No, we don't. That's. Balco will be good, because I think, yeah, there's not much alcohol here yet, hey. Okay, will stop, there we go, that's really the best, and this is, oh, actually, is we need to be fast, or actually, Dual Gildur is going to take it, because I have a feeling the, the elves will fall here, although the elves are overpowered, so they might not fall that easy, hey. He's a good general, for God's sake, but it's an Askel, so what can we expect? God, they have a lot of elves here, I was thinking they were weakened, but apparently they recovered. Oh well, that's how it goes. We'll deal with it. Strongest faction. Yeah. Who would have? Who would have? Who would have? Who would have wow. My words. Who would have thought that I would be the biggest faction in the game? Actually, we're gonna get ship rides here. For no, no. Actually, no. We don't need to. We're gonna get these guys. Yes, six turns and seven turns for these guys. Yes, we can actually get them now. We also can build a... Can I build? No, I can't build it yet because I don't have the the barracks yet. If I can add barracks, I will get a better uh, forge here. Which is, at the moment, where's my forge here? I'm pretty sure I have it. I mean, if I don't have it, it would be weird. So blacksmith, yeah, I can have an armor there now. Then we're going to get ship rides because this will be good. This thing. And, and that's the one I want. It will give me more trade in this area, which is going to be insanely good. Actually, we need to get this. <laughs> That's even better. It's actually built faster, and actually it will give you this. That's the one I want. To have more trade routes. Eh, caravan receive. It could be public good. Always good. Eh, better we just build that stuff, alright. I think we can already build, actually, there. What am I saying? I can, already, I can already build these guys. No, I can't. Where could I build them at? 
Ah, was it? What was here? Yeah, I can build him in San Anu. There we go. I can build him here. Seven turns. One turn. Oh no, it's climbing out. I thought it was the archers there. Okay. Um, not sure what you're doing here, but hey, you're, you're having fun there, I guess. All right. Two turn. One turn. Actually, yeah, I can build him pretty fast here already. What are you, Prim? Wow. He sounds dull. Oh well. We don't, can we make actual catapults? We can. Huh. I didn't know we actually had catapults. I've never seen them used. Orders. So I didn't know we could actually have them. Oh well, you learn every day. Faction announcements. Coming of age. Who are you? Oh, you're that guy. Alright. You're useless. Don't want you. Population. How the hell is Mortis still having more population than me? Okay, how it goes. Oh, well, actually, let's start doing suffer. something we should have been doing Your because enemy hey, shall fall this, swiftly. I'm just ranting here. The walls. Oh, and they actually decided to come outside. Alright. Don't worry, I haven't. You know, Orders. have you met my other armies that I have here? Remove. You know, you're trying to see Call just Gilead. Have you met my other friends? Like this army? As you win. And actually, we're gonna move even closer to it because I can. And I have more if you want. I mean. I can even move inside the city if you want. And then you shouldn't forget my other friend called... How may I serve? Actually, what we're going to do here, we're going to move these guys out. Move yes. over here. <laughs> I was getting this pissed, that's true, but hey. Orders. We're going to move some guys from here, like these guys. How may I serve? To Gilead. We march. Oh, and they're happy. Now, oh, that's, that's weird, isn't it? I'm going to build a shrine here, by the way. There we go. How much is the armor? I can... These guys, these places are very good for training places, by the way. Very good. You can also build some of the biggest. Uh. So, so you were trying to attack Minas Tirith, were you? Now, I'm not really sure that was such a good idea. By the way, you have very advanced army. Gondor archers, they're not that great. They're not as good as these guys, by the way. But they actually, they're more high tier than these guys. They actually, these guys are harder to get than these guys. These guys are can only be built in Italian, so that's their setback of it, of course. And then they have these guys, which are really good, so as you can see. I have nothing that can counter them, except my cavalry, so they're really, really strong. You can also root this if you want. So I do need to watch out for those, and their infantry is just plain good. Better than mine. So they do have a good army here, so I need to destroy them with numbers. I can't defeat Order. them with, you know... You can go march. there, have fun. Alright, so I can attack Noble this. We so I would have... Battle. Way less def uh, reinforcement than I thought I would. And he actually would be advantage here. Alright, so we're gonna actually get withdraw from battle for a second. How may I serve? I don't want to go inside the city. Um, As you win. Uh, yeah, how can I... T that's annoying, isn't it? In general. No, 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 come back! Uh, I messed that up. Well, nothing lost. Probably should have moved you around. Oh well. They'll probably attack me, so let's end the turn and see what happens. We're actually not doing much, but hey. Ten turns, see what happens. See what Gondor wants to do. Was that a Gondorian fault? I think it was. Got some Merkwood settlement there. Let's zoom out a bit. There we go. Move the infinite armies forward because, well, and our money situation is getting pretty poor, by the way. <laughs> if you haven't noticed that, uh, it's pretty bad. 26,000 only. We are building it all, but uh, still, it's pretty bad. Huh. You know, I should cut this out. This is ridiculous. Five years later. Come on, get a move gun. Get get all moving. Separating there we go. The Dolomrod. Dolomrod is also a faction I need to go after. Dolomrod, well, As you will. I kind of have to go the after army. them because what I did in the previous campaign, Separating I the men. had a horrendous war As with Rune. <laughs> it's pretty long, actually. Very hard war. A lot of lots of killing. Our I mean, a lot of killing. <laughs> I As mean, I'm will. talking about 5,000 stacks all the Splitting time. Like every turn, you had a new 5,000 army over there. It's like, the army. come on, where are you getting these guys from? Splitting okay, our forces. Even if As you will, splitting the army. You know, the thing is, you see the Harrodrim uh, map, you know, you see Harrodrim and their map information? Don't stop that. 
And you see on the le on the left, that's just Umba. I mean, I know the map formation of Umba, <laughs> except they've taken some of the Lombards' territory, which is possible. That's bad for them, not for me. It means Bree is getting stronger, do they not getting stronger, which could be fun. Financially, I'm totally broke. Oh god, that cost me a lot of money. This thing up went up with 20,000 in a matter of what? Holy crap, I'm, I'm, I'm poor right now. Um, Give me a sec. Alright, sorry about that. How the hell am I so poor all of a sudden? Well, I'm constructing a lot, so... Mortal loves me. Edwait. Oh, Edwait is more with Roha. Wait, weren't they more? Huh. I think I need to stop recruiting, man. Um, yeah, I kind of... Uh, definitely these... I want to... Uh, whatever. We can deal with it. Our economy can... Actually, our economy cannot deal with it at all. <laughs> God damn, our economy is in trouble. If I really need to, I will disband some of the weak units, I mean, really. Although, this is very good. This will allow my units to recruit, actually. And he's still in 20, 15%, come on, get to 75. Oh, I forgot about that, didn't I? Oh, well, so be it. Trading Greece, Lug Brands, oh, that's nice. You can actually use a Palatir now. Which I think you already could, what am I saying? Um... How may I serve? So you're not willing to fight here, are ya? As you win. Well, you're in a lot of trouble. Honor to serve. Orders. Noble one. You now have a lot of men to fight. <laughs> Alright. Um Yes. Before we do anything, None we'll of them play, shall escape play this us. guy out, which has a fair to amount battle. of men. I don't really have such good you actually have come across one. We actually can test those guys out how good they are. They have some Ghana defenders, which is the levy, some rebel, which is the levy by the way. <laughs> Uh, they have about four units of spiritual guardsmen, which is not great, and of course the general, which is of course good. The general is really good. All right, see you on the battlefield. Swiftly or slowly, I care not. All right, I'm gonna wait a little bit. There we go. That's way more than so much. The fog is just—I mean, the fog is pretty nice for fighting, but it's just a bit dull, isn't it? All right, so who are we gonna send forward in order to drag the ram into there? Uh, we can use our archers. Whatever. Go forward. Go forward, you are, you coward. All right, archers, all of you. Not many of them, actually. Get in this position. I probably should have done this before, but we have to wait for uh, for a ramp to bridge anyway. So might as well just do it now, right? There are not many towers, so we don't have to worry about it too much, which is decent. All right. So my archers are over here. My infantry over here. Over here. I actually need to use my Raminor to make more walls so I can have more guys pouring in. Eh, that probably would be a good idea. Alright. Get my cavalry going. You guys get the position over here quickly. Run forward. Thank you. You guys get over here. First breach the wall. Of course. There's their general hiding. That's a pretty big bodyguard. 38 is pretty big for a bodyguard. It's pretty good. I mean, the cavalry is not that bad, but it's not its not the best cavalry available as well, so... Mm, some militiamen, of course. This square is going to be taken very easy with some cavalry charge, so it should be very fast. Alright, so can you guys get a position? Thank you. We're going to fire at that general, because if you fire the general, we also hit the rapid. So, hey. It's a win. It's a win-win. Right. We can see also how the fifty crossmen are firing and actually watch them. The battering ram is in place. It will not be long before our enemies' defenses fall. You guys are firing pretty fast right now. Holy crap! Look at the fire rate. Look at that. Oh my god, this is good. All right, let's watch the crossmen how they're doing. Not firing. Are you gonna fire yet? It says you're firing. I mean, why the guy? Why the hell did my archers not do this last time? I mean. They don't have anyone in front of them, that's probably the difference, but still. Look at that. They're just, well, there's a territorial guardsman here, and rebel. No, the, now there are two units here. I didn't know. Oh, there's only one unit here. General is taking some fire, not much, but he's taking... Oh, actually, one of them died already. Why the hell did you not do this last time? I mean, last time you didn't do as much damage. Oh, now we'll see. If the, some units are running in front, so their fire rate will go down. Yeah, that wasn't okay. Now, now I understand. Okay, good. Our men have done well. I should just watch. The gates have fallen. Destroy them with my fire now. 
36. Alright, you can drop that ram, by the way. Actually, you can also move back over here quickly. Move, 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 move. Oh, you will die. Well, you will die. Have fun with that. Alright, archers, you can stop that. Thank you. You actually become archers as well. You can stop that. You can move over here. Closer. So you can actually fire this units coming closer, I think. Okay. You actually become more part one of one unit, by the way. Alright, so you move over here. My archers took a damage there. They'll be fine. It's a minor loss, hey. Cavalry, get closer. Right in there. Stop hitting my my arch! What are you doing? Get your move on! Come on! With horns move! Made of clay. Don't fight! We are winning the battle. I hate when infantry when they don't when they don't move when I want them to move. I mean, you're gonna stay there. You're gonna lose more units, idiot! Oh well. I'm right, gonna run in there with serpent with uh, serpent with like red roll of course. That should do a lot of damage. Just overrunning him, by the way. You're still not out of there, you idiots! What? Freaking move! Come on! He's not moving, is he? He's just not freaking moving, the idiots! Ugh, buffoons. Spire! Fire the rebel over there. Thank you. Alright. You guys, how much range do you guys have? You guys have no range. Oh. Um. That general is getting overrun, by the way. He's having no chance here whatsoever. So, you're firing still on Og, which you're doing a lot of damage. They are rebel, though, so. Yeah, considering your fire rate. We have taken the walls. Which is sometimes this time we always. captured this place. Uh, Alright, what our infantry is gonna do? Our infantry is gonna go. Uh, I think one side would be enough. Yeah, one side would be enough. So we're just gonna go to the center and just hit him from the two sides with Calvin. That'd be good. Yeah, that'd be good. Actually, we're gonna hit him from three sides with Calvin. You start moving over here, by the way. Move, start moving already. You're gonna be the one in the most rear. So, still fighting something. So, I'm not too sure where you guys all are, but hey. So. What is going to happen here is that you guys are all going to go over here, slowly moving forward. I do mean slowly. So I was going to stand all over here and have fun with that. Now you're going to get move on. Thank you. There we go. The general's around there somewhere as well. I'm not really sure where he exactly is, but hey. Alright, so you start moving over here. Actually, no, you go over here and here. There we go, and you will take this side from over here. That should be fine. So, there are rebel here in the way. There won't be much in the way. Alright, you, your job is to just go over there. Just get them, move, get them in the group, move in a the group. They're being blocked up here because of the general, I believe. But I, they should get through it eventually, I hope. I hope, I say. Alright, so I told you to move over there, thank you. You didn't do it. It's obedient, perfect. Alright, uh, you know what, just move over here first, thank you. That would be probably a good thing. I'd also be advised you actually can, are able to walk through a gate. That would be very happy ability. Apparently, you guys cannot do it. Why are you in? Why are you in, in melee combat? Of all things you could be in, you're in melee combat. Really? Really? You're in melee combat right now? How? With what? Did I told you to move here. No, I told you to move there. You are. Very, you. I hate you. Where's that general, by the way? Cut off the oh, head. well, there he is. Well, the there he general was. is slain. All right, now, now they, they should be. Oh, now they can get through. Head. I hope. Yeah, they're not really good at moving through gates, are they? Well. Oh, so they're all gonna march. Where, wait, where are the enemy armies? Where the hell are they? Oh, I didn't expect this to happen. What do you know? Who would, have, who would have thought that one ha would happen? Huh. What do you know? So... 
Yeah, we're just running through, aren't we? Yeah, just hit those guys. Do not run through those guys. They will do tremendous damage to you. Just fight them. Thank you. You're very handy. Right, you know what? You come here Victory and hit those guys. Well within our grasp. You hit them over here. I'm our foe. Will surely well. see this and lose heart. And you know what? You charge to that. I mean, maybe you'll do some damage. Who knows? You also would use the red rod. Use your damage over there. I'm not sure what you guys are going to do, any, to be honest again, but hey. To be honest, I just should go after you guys. You guys, uh, do not worry anything. My lord! Curses! Her men no longer command well. the city! I just need to make these guys break, and as soon as they break, well, we kinda got them. How much do you do? Nothing. There were a lot of guys there as well, so I don't really... Uh, well, expect them to do a lot of damage there. Okay. So there are a lot of guys here, but not much damage has been done. Alright, move over here quickly. Then move over there, and over here. Some rebel here. They're broken, yet you're not... Hit them over here. Hit them. Go over there. There we go, there we go. Now you charge them now. Oh, look at all those dead bodies. You can, all those dead guys you just gained. Perfect, isn't it? Alright, now you guys move over here to those rebel guys. We're gonna move on. Come on. It's only four. Now, if I didn't direct you to be correct, you would have got maybe way less. So I'm not really sure what, what are they doing here. Oh, they're moving back to their square. Okay, that's that's interesting. We time speed. Uh, wait, then I told you to move in. There we go. Move and run in there. Come on, move and run in there. Come on. Move in there. Come on, there we go, we can hit the flank over here. We're gonna walk in right now, save our guys a little bit. Our guys are completely spread out, holy crap, well, what is this guy still doing here? There's a random guy in the back, is still here, like, he's just doing nothing. What the hell are you doing? Get in there and fight, maggot. Wait, what are you, what are you guys doing? What? Okay, um... Okay, uh, randomly just one guy appears there. Now, what would be smart, I mean, really, this would... I mean, it might be a shock to you, but what would be smart if you move in with, like, over here? That would, that would be good, wouldn't it? I mean, over here. Like, you don't only fight here. You just fight the entire length of the this, this shield. That would be also good. I might, I might seem very advanced, but I uh, should use these guys, but I'm not using them. Uh, probably should use them. A full Let's fight with horns here. made of clay. We are winning the battle. Let's not do that, by the way. Um, <laughs> reinforcements from the back, but that will leave some open from the charge from over here. This side is protected from the charge, so that's annoying. But this side is completely wide open, so yeah, they're in trouble. Our guys are moving in slightly, but here they're getting overrun, which isn't smart of them, but hey, we can do that. I think it was. It could have been a way better truck, but at least he's trying. Hey, at least he's trying, right? That's the most important thing. Get that! Oh, now, now, now you're moving in. Perfect. Now you're doing something useful. That was well, decent. Could have been Victory better. Is so. Well within our grasp. At least put the time over there. will surely see this and lose heart. This is just one massive, you know, slaughter. Class. We do need to kill them all. So, right. those guys. Thank you. you. Guys are pretty accurate, so we should be able to hit those. This rabble here will not hold the line. <laughs> I'm pretty sure about that. They will not hold the line. As soon as I can start charging here, this should take a fairly big amount of damage. That was a good charge for me. Now as well. Not sure, sure how much you killed, but that seems like quite a lot for your number. That seems like quite a lot in your back. That's pretty good. Also weaken their morale, so we also weaken up with. We are slowly starting to surround them. Although that's a very in line here, I might say that. 
So they actually gave up and actually sent more men to this side. So that means that they're left open for a charge. It means I will use that. This charge eh, did some damage. Much. Whatever it does, it actually is, you know, reinforcing and surrounding them more, so might not do a lot of damage, it's just surrounding them, so. I'm not sure why you are in melee, but still somehow you're in melee. How I have no Only idea half the time. enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. You know, he's the smallest bodyguard, but still he's doing the most damage. At least visible visible damage. The other ones I can't really see how much they're doing. And I can see some damage here, but this guy has done a lot more damage, I see, I, I believe, on his own. He will check out. He's the third in rank, I believe, or the second in rank. Oh, that thing was a lot of damage. At least morale damage, because they all wave from here. And that was a lot of damage, too. You can see the death here. Although, he, again, it's very good charge. At least is weakening them up a bit, so that's good. We're gonna lose a lot of guys here, by the way, more than I would expect it. We're gonna lose more than thinking those Gilead, which is interesting because the Gilead had way better armor. Okay. If I didn't do it correctly, let's get to six times speed. It's about me just running them over now. It's just a slaughter fest now. Not specials happening. Those guys from over here. All right, now they should be completely no, they're not. Yeah, they're about to be completely surrounded. So okay. let's just launch this now. They're all pinned down, and now my last cavalry charge from over here. Finish this. Thank my you. lord, our men are in command of the city. No kidding. And that should be the end of them. Oh, they're gone. I'm not really sure how much they killed. I don't think too Great much. Great victories are like sweet nectar. Come, oh, let us drink of the most also. rare and glorious fruit. Right, let's see how my crosswomen did. I don't think they were doing that well. They are not... Yeah, they, they killed nothing. I didn't think they actually fired. Maybe they should have fired. I mean, they probably could do a lot of damage, but hey. My clan, got, my clan hunters did some damage, not much, actually very few to be honest. They seem to be very open, uh, you know, open uh, plane fighters, where they have a very good line of sight. If they get a good line of sight, they are devastating, but else, they're not that great. Of course, my caravan did the most, I think, yeah, I actually think he killed the most here. Maybe that last charge on this guy did a lot of damage as well. This, I mean, you can see some damage here, definitely, but can't kind of measure it, of course. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed it. Please go and subscribe. Please go and read and subscribe if you did. And see you next time. Probably to fight that big army of Gondor, which is very elitist. See you then.